The pandemic caused a housing boom and an insufficient amount of supply led to bidding wars that made buying a home an unaffordable dream to many. But with the rise of interest rates, markets have slowed down, leaving many to question, now what? Buyer has an upper hand on the seller because these prices are adjusting now. The sellers are starting to um, get nervous if their home is sitting on the market more than a week now. And that might drive home prices to fall this year. But GP Thoreau, a mortgage expert, tells buyers to avoid making low ball offers if they're looking to buy a forever home anytime soon. We're coaching our clients, consulting you know, them how to approach when they're making an offer to have the seller buy down their rate, and that's huge. A buy down is when a borrower pays the lender more money up front at closing to obtain a lower interest rate. That strategy could make a bigger savings stent on the mortgage payment than offering a couple of thousand dollars less on the home. So when negotiating on either side, buyer or seller, keep in mind that there is a whole lot to negotiate beyond just the bottom line price. That includes home repairs like a new roof, tax transfer, title insurance, buying down your rate, buying a home warranty to cover your future home repairs, and contributing to closing costs. And since there is room for negotiation and we are in a buyer's market, raise your home search by $20,000 over your budget. That's actually going to increase the number of homes in your search and test your negotiation skills while you're at it. I'm Susan Hogan, News 4.